Hi, I'm Ross Everett. I'm Lee Newton. Welcome to SourceFed. At this very moment, basketball courts across the country are filled with aspiring basketball players practicing a game they love with hopes of one day playing in college, the NBA, and then eventually squatting in someone else's home trying to rent it on Craigslist. As any good basketball fan knows, the arc of an NBA star's career is about as diverse as the cast of a Disney show, ranging from winding up as coaches, commentators, or flat out broke. The latter seems to be the case for former Golden State Warriors power forward Chris Gatling, who recently got busted for not only living in someone's Arizona home, but trying to rent it out on Craigslist. Craigslist. Like you do. Turns out it's harder than you think for a former NBA player to rent out someone else's home for $800 a month, as he had to list it multiple times. But he was able to get one potential renter to shell out a down payment. Gatling managed to get into the house by breaking into a key box of the Arizona home while the owners were living in California. Owning two homes must be nice. Owning one home must be nice. Looking at homes must be nice. You know what's fun? Roofs. Just I having them roofs. over your head. Rain doesn't touch you. You know what's you. great? Not having a landlord. Oh. Gosh, one day. A lawn? Nah, not gonna happen. You have to mow that. Gatling pleaded guilty to the theft and forgery charges and will be sentenced on October 4th. Needless to say, he committed a despicable and ridiculous crime. Renting out someone else's property? Who would do that? Oh, are you Lee Newton? Yes, I am. I saw your posting online for men's jeans. Oh, they are right over there. Lee, you sold my jeans? Yeah, totally. They won't even fit you. Take them off. I'm not gonna wear them. He's not gonna wear them. Oh, am I gonna wear them? This is <laughs> so ridiculous. <laughs> Take them off! How am I the weird? one here. All right, I'm yeah. Sorry, is show involved? No, no, I'm sorry. Was I apologize. Yeah, totally <clears throat> different though. Thank you. You got it. I'm gonna need that PayPal. Uh. Accept money orders? Or? Yeah, I do. Cool. Do you barter? I'd love to. Ooh, I'd love a hat. I've got a sand pail. Have you ever known someone to sell another person's property? Let us know in the comments down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel and click this annotation for our five daily stories and everything we've ever done. I'm Ross Everett. I'm Lee Newton. It's quite profitable. Very, it really is. I'm very cold. Yeah, oh, you have to wait here though because someone else is coming in for your shirt. These are slightly used. They're more than slightly, I brother. I feel like I let you know that. Okay, Listen. well, it didn't say it in the description and honestly, the man that was wearing these pants looks nothing like that potato head over there. Oh no, oh, no. I'm out of the country. Great, again out of jeans I'm not gonna wear. They're just feelings, they'll heal.